surrounds me If we hold ourselves together we'll go far Hey guys, Video for Essentials here. For today's video, I'm going to be starting off with Dollar Tree mirrors. These are the mirrors that they have in the Dollar Tree. And it has provision for hanging. I thought about using these mirrors, but then I changed my mind and used these ones instead. I spray painted them gold and I'll be keeping them aside for now. I'll be cutting this leftover PVC pipe down to size. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. I spray painted them gold and then took a leftover dowel that is the same size as the pipes that I used. It's already in gold. Now I'm going to be cutting out four little pieces from this dowel. After that, I'm going to be attaching them to the pipes. I'll be attaching pieces from an old spool to the ends of what I've just made. For the shelving, I was thinking about using this frame here and then removing the glass and using it as a shelf. But the glass was too light. I thought I could manage it, but it's too light. I then decided to see if I can use just the frame the way it is. And then I changed my mind altogether and kept it and got hard acrylic sheet from Home Depot. To attach this to what I've just made, I will need glass holders. And I ordered these online and I'll leave a link for this down in the description box below.
The next thing I'll do is firmly attach the mirrors to the bottom of what I've just made and I'll be using screws to attach them together. I'm gonna take this out and spray paint it gold. I like to have some sort of reflection at the top. So I'm gonna be cutting flexible mirror sheets into circles and attach them to what I've just made. The mirrors from the Dollar Tree already come with provision for hanging. I cut the acrylic sheet that I got from Home Depot into smaller sizes and then glued them together at four sides of each of the glass and I glued three together to make them thick. Now what I'm going to do now is attach what I've just put together inside the glass holders. I'm going to take off the protective films that I have on the flexible sheets and cover the opening on the pipe here with gems. This is easy to move around, easy to mount, and it can hold heavy items as well. I have the perfect place where I'm going to mount this and it will be in my bathroom where I have shelves that I made that were kind of small. So I'm going to replace it with what I've just made. This design can be used in a lot of ways. This is a popping shelving idea that still keeps your glam and style in check. I'm going to make more of these and use them for something else and share with you guys. Now, I hope you all enjoyed this video and learned one or two things from it. Now, don't forget to like it and share it with your friends and families as well. Thank you all so much for watching. I have other home decor DIY videos that are linked in the description box below to check them out. And don't forget to click on the subscribe button.